Hi, this is Faye Ellington. It's been over a week since I last chat with you with my COVID-19 chronicles. Man, I can't believe that these chronicles have brought so much joy to so many people and I am so happy about that. Jamaicans at home and abroad in the diaspora have had responses from so many people and even some people are not Jamaicans. But you know, as long as I can bring a little laughter along with the seriousness, then I'm happy about that. But I want to challenge you today, during this time when you're at home, adults, young adults, children, I want to encourage you to read something, read a book either written about a Jamaican or by a Jamaican, particularly from the younger Jamaicans or of Jamaican families living overseas who may not really fully understand our culture and our history and the contribution of persons. I'm asking you to do that. I have a few of them here. Let's begin with this one. Yeah, the big man himself. Right? I'm going to ask you to read a book. Here's one that you might be interested in, You Usain Bolt. And, um, you know, we talk about him and revere him, but maybe you really need to hear his story. How he put one foot in front of the other. Oh, yes, no pun intended. And um, got to where he is, the fastest man in the world. Here's another book by an educator. She was a uh, principal of Arden High School, Esther Tyson. And she's called this book, As Some Seat, As Some Said, Commentary on the Social and Educational Issues in Jamaica. So it's a number of different things that she may have published in the newspapers. And so you can get different perspectives on different things. So this is another book. Of course, you can read anything you want to read, but I'm just recommending these. And here is this one. Look at that. Yeah. R. Danny Williams, a businessman. This is a man who you can remember, or perhaps you don't know, started Life of Jamaica, the insurance uh, company, big, big, big insurance company, which is now Sajiko Jamaica. And you know what is interesting about this man? He also built the first apartment building in Jamaica. So I was asking you to read something, but here's a bigger challenge. After you finish read, I want you to post some comments on my YouTube channel to say what you have read, how it inspired you, what you found as a main message in there, what you didn't know about the person. Just choose any book written by a Jamaican or about a Jamaican. Read and put some comments, of course, about this um, COVID-19 chronicles as well. So I want to leave you with something that might put a a little laughter in your day. This is called From Behind the Counter, written by Easton Lee. He's now Father Easton Lee. When I first met him, he was broadcaster and a theater person, actor and producer. And he was a man who wrote and produced a uh, uh, let me tell you, every Easter we used to do this thing across the island in churches, the rope and the cross, and I'm just reflecting on it with people like Leonie Forbes, Ruth O'Shea, Grace McGee, Alwyn Scott, and so many others. But here's a poem by Easton Lee called Happy Anniversary. Is 75 years now we're dead together. Mm. Married for 70. Today is the anniversary. Nobody asks me why we never married before. That I know your business, you're too inquisitive. Yes, plenty, plenty things we got through, you know. Mm, plenty laughter and happiness. Enough grief and enough tears. Enough, enough I water flow, both for joy and for sorrow. Ah, oh, these many years. You see him there? <laughs> All brought death like a bat. A miserable can't done. But I saw him give me trouble. I saw me love him. It's a long time now we are love and find virtue now with one another. If me was to be married again, it would have to be him, same one, no other. For him is my husband, my father, my brother, my best friend. Mm. Me know some bad-minded people I wonder say, where me sip on him and where him sip on me. Well, every nuku have their suku. Me and him belongs together. And every who got their tikka bush. And him a fi me tick. <laughs> God make him fi me and me fi him. And I not really bush me find him, you know. Mm -mm. Meet him one day I come from church. Mm. Love at first sight, so they say. And I didn't look no further. <laughs> Through ups and downs, prosperity and adversity, tick and tin, whole heap of adoration, 
we stick together all these loving years never thinking of leaving oh never think of divorce or separation mm -mm. but lord you know how much time i think of murder <laughs> COVID-19 Chronicles from Faye Ellington. Remember now, I want you to read a book and I want you to put what you've read and um, a book about somebody to make on. Either them write it themselves or somebody write it about them. So walk good till next time. But remember now, seriousness, wear your mask. Once you're going out, wear your mask. Please keep your distance six feet or more. Mm -hmm. And if you don't have to go out, nobody go out. If you don't have to go out, me I beg you, no bother go out. This thing is serious and it's going to get even more serious. What good till next time? Faye Ellington here.